You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Thanks for stopping by today. I appreciate it. I am moving along in a mini series of these McDonald's toys that uh, change. These are called McDino Changeables. I started with the 1992 set, was it, that I had mislabeled? And I'm working my way backwards because the last set I have the most toys and boxes to sort through. So let's see, we have collect all eight. So let's see, one. Uh, that's a single cheeseburger, a double cheeseburger. Now this says week one, I just noticed. This says week three. So let's get through this here. Small fry chain. This is the under three toy at the time. Pretty neat. Didn't know I even had that. Okay, number two. So week one, you got the single cheeseburger. Week two, you got the hot cakes. Week three was the fries. Now this says week one. Hmm. Oh, you know what? I think there's two in each group. Let's see if I remember correctly. This says McDino Cone Changeables. Collect all eight while supplies last. This does not. Oh, wait, right there. Collect all eight. Doesn't give me a week on that one. Hmm. What's going on here, McDonald's? This says week two. It looks. Oh, a McNuggets container. So there's two in each category. This says week three, but I have that one. This says week, doesn't say. So it looks like these week threes go together and then these go together. So two, four, six, eight. I'm guessing that is correct. And that was the under three toy. So now let's just see. So I have two of these extra, so that goes with that one. But I don't have to open the bag, I will leave the bag. But we'll take a look at it. And then here are two of these, of the singles. Those are extra. So this one is extra, we'll leave that in the bag. Speaking of bags, I have a couple here. Let's see what I have. Okay, so this looks like the bag. That goes to this set. Let me just verify. I have the right year. 1991. So that is it. Okay. So there's everything that I have at the time that came with these toys. So let's just see. All right. So I will need this instruction sheet. I'll tell you what. I'm just going to open them all up. I have to pull the instruction sheet out anyway. These will go off to the side. All right, so let's start with week one. Well, actually, let's start with the bag. We'll take a look at that, and then we'll go through all the toys together. Okay, let's see. What always follows a dinosaur home? Its tail. How do you know how much a dinosaur weighs? Check its scales. How funny is that? I have one bedtime tale. Number two, tell, tell does this, tail ring bell, don't let a, oh, I don't know, through your bedroom door or you'll never sleep. Okay. Hmm. Someone explain that one to me. And then the picture on this side, it says, these two McDinos are having a ball. You can have fun, too, by finding five pairs of matching things in this prehistoric scene. scene. Five things that are matching. I see two butterflies. I see two erupting volcanoes. Two bones. Two of these leaves. Two of these rocks. Let's see, do we get them all? Bones, leaves, rocks, volcanoes, and butterflies. Did I say butterflies? I don't remember. And then let's see, just in case there's anything on the side. Sometimes later on they can print them on the side. Okay, nothing on the sides of that bag. All right. Cool looking bag, what do you think? All right, let's see. So week one had these two toys. Ooh, I can't wait to check them out. Let me get my scissors. Let's open up this one first. 
I really want to look at the piece of paper. That's the only reason I'm going to open it. Follow these simple steps to change a quarter pounder with cheesesaur to its dinosauric form. Step one. Step one. Pull this up or out. I don't know. Step one, yeah, it looks like this comes out. Now, it's a new toy, so maybe it just hasn't had a chance to open up. You know what I mean? Or I'm not understanding how this opens up. Yeah, it looks like this whole thing pulls out. There we go. I was just trying to pull the top. Okay, so that pulled out. Step two, something's going to flip out. I see it. I don't know what... Oh, here it is. Okay. Oh, look at him in there. How cool is that? And then, so they have it like this. This is how he is supposed to stand. There. That's cool. That is really cool. So the front says, Quarter Pounder with Cheeses, sir. McDino Happy Meal, changeables. Collect all eight while supplies last. Week one. All right, so we have week one. Let's move week one off to the side. Let's check this guy out. Let's get out of the plastic before I try to read what it says. Okay, that bag goes with that. I try to keep everything as organized as possible. I'm sure you all know that. I don't need to say that. Okay, same thing here. So this is called the Happy Mealodon. A Mealodon. Step one, it looks like something with the McDonald's logo folds out. There we go. Okay. I think that's it. Yes, yeah, so that's what he looks like. So he's hollow on the inside because that's where his, his head goes in. I like that one. Got a little handle, you can carry him around. Do, 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 do. The Happy Meal Odon. All right, well, that is the second one. Let's look at week one. So, if you were a kid at this time or an adult and you liked Happy Meal toys, these are the two you got. So, you're probably so looking forward to week two, weren't you? All right, let's get week two in here. Week two. Let's get these out of the way. Okay. McNuggets Asaurus. What's a McNuggets Asaurus? The reason I did it this way is so that we can compare now this set to the earlier set and see how much they changed. So I can't wait to get to that last set and just show you. Okay, so he's gonna look like this little guy. I mean, just by looking, it looks as though you're gonna pull these little legs out. You push in there, and then you flip up there, and there he is. Oh, that one's cool. I like that one. He's like, it looks like his little shell, his McNugget shell. And it's a six-piece McNugget. Super little fella. Do, 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 I will show them all to you, of course. Okay, now this one, now look. Now why, 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 McDonald's, why does this one have a different pamphlet in it? And this one has this, oh, so this is hotcake pseudactyl, like pterodactyl, I guess. Oh yeah, it does look like a pterodactyl. All right, so there's something, his head's poking in here. Okay, there's his head. And then what's going on here? These poke out, pull out. Oh, that one is pretty neat. I know I've said that for all of them so far, but look at that. Over $12 in savings. McDonald's bonus book. Mom and Dad, look inside. On any regular price, $20 purchase at Kids and More at Sears. Come see our fantastic selection of clothing nursery stuff. Any regular price nursery item at Sears. Northern Napkins, 
25 cents off a pack of Northern. Kids videos on sale, Baby Rock and McTreasure Island. Don't know either of those. Curad Kid Size. Curad's a Band-Aid. Are they still around? Finally, finally, bandages that fit kids. Delicious sun-kissed fruit taste. Multivitamins and the multivitamin complete for our kids. Mickey's Parade Frozen Treats, available in local grocers. There's a variety of treats in there for you to get. Creamsicles, popsicles, and fudgesicles. Save on Dixie Tiny Toon Adventures Cups. Colgate Jr. Healthy Teeth, Happy Smiles. Colgate Jr. Specially Designed for Kids. As a Happy Meal customer, we consider you a very special friend of McDonald's. That's why we're glad to offer you and your family this coupon book filled with savings on popular name brand products. Use this book to enjoy savings on a wide variety of well-known and trusted brands. This extra bonus is just our way of saying thank you for choosing McDonald's. Well, thank you, McDonald's, and thank you for this toy. Pretty cool toy. I'm going to put them all back in their shape, but I want to grab the next set. And then I will open and close them just so we can get a good idea. Ooh, okay. Let's save, let's save that one. Let's do the Fryceratops. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I think the book is going to be exactly the same, but let's just see. Bonus book. Coupon. Yes, exactly the same. So we've seen that. All right. Step one, pull back the fry head. Oh yeah, look at him in there. So he looks like he's gonna run this way. And then step two, oh, I know I'm not paying attention. Something pulls out. Step two, it's like feet from the bottom. So he's like this and it's like they turn out or something. There we go. He's popped down. I was trying to do that. It just could be that the toy hasn't really, of course, been played with. There. Oh, and there's a little tail. It looks like a tail. There. There we are. Yeah, another cute little toy. And we'll definitely check out. Oh, see this one? Now that I know that there's a tail, this guy had a tail. That's why I want to look at them in a little more detail. I think I got the rest. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So let's move this guy out of the way. Let's get the double, the big double cheeseburger. Same book. This guy is called the Big Macasaurus Rex. Collect all eight while well, supplies last. Okay, so it looks like his head's gonna pop out of the top. Which way though? That way. Ooh, he looks a little scared or confused. Then he sits like this and his little feet pop out. Oh, there they are. His tail, his hands, or feet. Okay, so that's how he looks. Okay. Over here. I'm gonna move some things out of the way so I can remember how all this goes back in the backs. Right, just keep looking at him. I'll be with you in just a second. Week 22. All right. There's three. Okay. Now we've seen this guy. All right. What's next? The next week. <laughs> Let's do this one. Try shake a tops. You ever had a try shake a tops? Sorry, trying not to stop and just keep going here. Try shake a tops. It's a dinosauric form. Oh yeah, we've read that already. 
It looks like the whole thing, oh, oh, the whole thing opens. There he is, his little straw is his bottom. The tail comes out this way. And where's his feet? Oh, I think they're just built in. I think he just like that. He's like a little tower. Yeah. They don't show anything else here that I could see. It looks like this is screwed in here, so that doesn't move. This doesn't move. I think that's it. So he's just standing up real tall and proud. All right, you go here. This one is called McDino Cone. McDino Cone. Step one. I've seen this toy before. He pops out of the top. There he is. Ah, that's a cute one. And then his arms look like they're gonna, ooh, they go up. Okay, they don't show any tail. They show them, that's it. Doot, 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 doot. There's that one. We do need to check out that under three of the changeables. I'll bring these all back in just a second. Now the reason it's under three, like I said previously, one, it's a softer material, and two, there's no moving pieces on it. This one was called Small Friceratops. Safety tested for children of all ages. Let's see, 1990 McDonald's Corp, Thailand. It's got that like plastic squishy toy feel. It's a McDonald's fry. All right, that one is cool. They're all cool, aren't they? All right, let me get them all in here one more time and then I'll transform them, play with them a little bit more and we'll just kind of get a better feeling for them. I'm gonna say without a doubt, probably one of the coolest Happy Meal toy sets I have ever seen. I know I've said that a few times, but here, this one, you have to admit, is a pretty cool set. So let's get these guys in, back to where they were so we could see them as their original selves. Hmm, I don't know if I have a favorite. I think they're all just interesting and unique. See, now we know how to do it. It goes quicker. Does it make you hungry for McDonald's? It sure does. Got to get that in first. That's for me. I haven't had lunch, so where's that one? Okay, look at that. Pretty cool. Now let's see how quickly I can transform them back. I already forgot. Oh, there it is. Just gotta get your fingers in there. Okay. Now the pressure's on. Ah, I like that one. I think I like the coloring on that one the most. Oh yeah, these were tough to pull out. Pretty neat. Okay, hopefully I haven't forgotten anything. Oh yeah, that's his head. This thing just pops open. That actually went all the way down. 
Not sure I was supposed to do that. This guy pops up. No tail on him. Okay. There you go. Let's get a let's get an extreme close up. How's that? Extreme Happy Meal toy close up. Let's turn this guy this way. There we go. Let's take a top down look. I do have to do this one more time just so that I can understand them completely. Those are little dinosaur eyes, like puppy dog eyes, but a dis dinosaur. How's that? Okay, I gotta ask you, which one do you like the most? I do like the middle one, the purple and the white. I, don't, I just like the coloring on that one. That guy there. Okay, so this comes out. Then this. Oh, yeah, there's a little lip there. Okay, let me get this right. This comes out. Then this. Then this. This one here. Legs up, tail up. Head in, down. So you just put your finger, actually press there is easier. Press there is easier. Press there and open up there. This guy probably the easiest of them all. Okay. Let me just leave them in the closed state so we can get a final look at them. This one, fold the head down, then close it up. See, I just, I like the coloring and look at that. That's another easy one. I guess they're easy, I just forget. Oop, remember that, head in, tail in, there we go. Maybe that's the easiest one. Okay, look at that. I'm getting better at it. Pretty cool little toys. Let's just give you a nice close look at those. Because I did not show you that. But I think you get the idea. Have I overshown them to you? I don't know. Ah, what a wonderful set of toys. I can't wait to get to the last set. So there you go. The McDino Changeables Happy Meal Toys. Now there is one more giant set I have with a lot more toys that I've collected and found over the years. I'm finally getting to them. Again, let me know, what is your favorite? And don't say the hotcakes just because I, well, yeah, you could say the hotcakes. This one's my favorite. It is the coolest one, I have to say. Look at that. Whoosh. Now, let's see. Now I remember this. This pulls, this here. Oh, that's this side. No, I had it right. Oh, come on. Oh, here, sorry. <laughs> okay, let's do that one more time. Pulling the wrong way. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, okay, I got it. He kind of looks like a moon, doesn't he? He's got a half-shaped moon face. Like, don't mind me, the video's over, you can go, I'm just having fun. Dino Attack! Now these, I could see you just playing with these in McDonald's as a kid, at the table, would have been one of the coolest toys. It's easier for a little. Oh, you could do that too. Look. Do, 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 do. Psh, psh. Crush, crush, crush. Well, there you go. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed this video. I had fun making it for you. Let me know your favorites 
Even if it's my favorite, it could be your favorite, right? And, uh, you know, I'll get to that next set pretty quick. I'm trying to get through toys, uh, upping the videos. I decided now it's time to up the videos again. So that's what I'm going to do. And thanks for watching, everybody. Look at that description, please, 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 please. There is a playlist there for all my retro toys. Later. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up.